Hello guys, in this video we will see how we can create easily a minimap in Godot. First, let's save our main scene, and then we can create a new scene to become our player. As we are not creating a real player at this example, I will just put a sprite to represent our player. And we will use a texture rect just to fast make a ground to us. Let's increase the size of this ground and change the scratch mode to tile. So it will repeat to fill out the size. Now let's just change the index here to bring the player to the top. Let's just rename our player to identify it easier later. And we can create a script to manage the player movement. Then we run our project to see that we are able to move the player. Okay, now we need to add a 2D camera to our player so that it will make more sense to have a minimap. Let's just add a new sprite here with a house to use as a reference when we are moving later. Let's create a new scene that will become our minimap. This scene will have a controller, a view container, a viewport, and inside this viewport, we will create an instance of our player scene. Now we just need to define the size of the viewport container and the size of the viewport. So we can already see our player scene inside the viewport. Now let's add a script to our minimap. And at this script, we will access the camera 2D inside our player scene and change the zoom to 8A, so the zoom will be 8 times smaller. We use this zoom because without it, the scene will be exactly the same size as it is at the original player scene, and it will not make sense for a minimap. Let's just make a test without the zoom, just to see the result. Ok, now we can put the zoom back. Let's just add a new sprite to be the border of our minimap. I've made a mistake here and I draw the sprite with the wrong dimension. But I liked it more at this size, so I went back to our viewport and to our viewport container and changed in both the y-axis to 150. And now we can go back to our main scene and make a test adding our player scene and our minimap scene. And we can see that they are both working, but that's not the result we want. We need to fix the minimap to our camera. 
But if we try to add a minimap directly at the player's scene at the camera, we will see that that's not possible to do. And that happens because the player is inside the minimap. But we can easily do it with a simple script. So let's go back to our main scene. We can delete this minimap scene. Now let's create a new script. In this script we will first reload the minimap scene. Then we create a variable to hold an instance later. And here we create a function to set our minimap. Then we put a map instance at the mm variable and add this mm variable as a child of the camera 2D that's inside our player scene. Then of course, inside our ready function, we need to call this setMM function. And then we can run it. And now we see that everything is working. We just can make some minor adjusts, like change the minimap position. And of course we can make another adjust, like increase the zoom out. Or maybe we want to increase the size or change the color of the player at the minimap. Yep, so the chains are limited to your creativity. And so, that's it for this video guys, I hope you enjoy it. If so, please consider subscribe, give a thumbs up, leave a comment. All of this really helps to motivate me to keep doing videos. Thank you for watching, bye!